Hi, and I'm back with the Mix Daily Training. I hope you're doing well. So, let's start. Let's have a fun stream and let's go. You're doing well. Great. All right. Let's do this and play in G. Morozevich. He's from, I don't know. And that looks like a good match. A uh, good start to a game. <coughs> let's skip this part. Uh, let's play. So, I'll play c5, then b6 idea. Yep. Well, b6, there is d5. But d5, there is b6. No, 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 wait. Oh, I don't want to go for... <coughs> nah, let's go for d5, never mind. Because b6, d5. I guess maybe he would not play it, but... There was a chance he would play it, and I don't want to... <clears throat> to him to play it. Yeah. These. <clears throat> That's. I'm not sure. It may be weird, but prevented bishop c5 before. I'll play. Uh, I'm playing a5 now. <clears throat> so, yeah, bishop d6. Castle. <clears throat> um. <clears throat> Okay, um, <coughs> okay, sorry, uh, queen e7, though I just blundered a pawn, but nice, he did not take it, doing correct CD, <laughs> just kidding, of course, mm, let's see, mm-hmm, <coughs> Three, maybe the move he will play. Oh, queen's two. Interesting. Let's see. Bishop b8, d takes c, c takes d. <coughs> that is looking pretty good. Let's see. If knight b5, maybe e5 or c takes d, e5. Yeah. All right, <laughs> yeah, maybe I needed to develop my bishop and rook, but why wouldn't there is a free pawn? Why should I take it? <laughs> I'm not sure, but yeah, I, I, bishop d7, rook c8 would be a bit too, not a bit, very passive, <clears throat> and I don't want it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oi, oi, oi. Let's see. C takes D. <laughs> I won't calculate more because it seems like E takes D, F. D takes C, D takes C, C takes D, I'm a bishop up, knight B5, F, G takes C, and D3, and I will be a bishop. Or knight up, I think he may have blundered. <clears throat> Though I'm not exactly sure. E5? I think it's him he will play, but I think it's not. I know. So we'll see. But still, being two points up, it's very good. <coughs> yeah. E5, D, C, E, F. Not sure anymore, um, but yeah, maybe he won't play e5. That's also the same, which may happen. Okay, he goes for knight d5. That's interesting. <coughs> if e takes d, I just have queen e2. No, rook e1, and my queen is trapped. <coughs> and I'm not the biggest fan of trapping my own queen, I think. Yeah, I think so. So I think like 95.
Make you five, yeah. <clears throat> Here, thinking about like win c7, the idea of knight d5, though he meant knight c4, then he may play f4, and I'm not really sure. Which plays 70 is like knight b5, I think. g6 basically queen e5 is the idea <laughs> i thought i might against the bishop so eh. oh so yes two pawns aha uh -huh. so you took three pawns uh, so it's yes, only one pawn so that's pretty interesting i think yeah e4 probably was a blunder from my opponent mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> bishop g5 is interesting, I think. Hmm. Place bishop d3. Mm hmm. Let's see. Uh, queen d6. He has G, uh, yeah, he has G3. 25 made of 3. Oh, well, Queen E5, uh, Queen C7, he's interested, and G3, I have Bishop H3. Yes, <laughs> a free pawn is always nice. So let's try it. Maybe it's not great, maybe I need Queen D6, but I'm not sure. If f4, there is bishop a7, bishop e3. Yeah, he goes for f4. Bishop a7, bishop e3. <coughs> That's interesting. Even though I have advantage, I think it's not so simple to win. Let's see, bishop a7. <coughs> Here, r uh, 8 Moves his queen. Mm -hmm. Let's play rook e8. Yeah, here I have knight f4. <laughs> a free pawn doesn't land the root. I have queen f4, so I will sink. Nah, knight f4 feels better, but maybe not. Poor boom. Nah, knight f4. <laughs> so basically, knight b5, I will take, and then he has queen f2, c, knight 7 I. Ouch. Be actually blundered. Oops. Yeah, I think I did. I need to win it for. Queen e5. Maybe that's even worse <laughs> than bishop f2 would be. Here I at least like have rook here, knight here, queen here, queen here. 
we have two rook of 293 hmm. <coughs> I'm not sure Queen g5 Moves his skin somewhere. I think like h1 or h2 probably. Then I have rook e2. We need to see this. Knight g4. <coughs> then knight g3 and that's gg. Whoa, I'm not sure. That's right. Sure. <laughs> I think I may be playing close to fire and I think I already did blunder my advantage, so yeah. We'll see. Okay. You got an exchange. He still take this bishop, I think. No, we skin. Then I have bishop d7, knight 7 rook a7. Aha! And otherwise I'll take a knight d5. Oh, nice! Here. <laughs> it's not so nice as so. Okay, takes. If bishop d6, I'll play bishop c4. He will take, I will take. And basically an exchange up. Woo! That looks good! <coughs> so, right now I feel like this game <coughs> is with a lot of blunders from both sides. Here. Rook a8. Here. Mm-hmm, 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 <coughs> faint. That. Six, I'm pretty sure. <coughs> I don't think my position is so great as I thought it was. But okay. Let's see. Uh huh. He doesn't go for that. Well then, kidney seven, kidney six. Now it looks good. <laughs> that doesn't look good because he's looking fun. Here. <coughs> Damn 
much about that. T5 would be a draw, but I'll, I'll try to win this. Because yeah, I'm an exchange up. Usually when you're an exchange up, you don't want to... Oh well, here I'll take. Here, here. I won't complain. I'm a pawn up. Uh, check. Here. <clears throat> B5. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Check. Let's see. I like that. That end game. Mm-hmm. Okay, six. Hmm. Interesting defense from my opponent actually. Mm-hmm. 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 I can see the way to win. Let's play. Five, I'm not sure about that move. In here.
from the DMG Moto Zebish. Whew, good game. Is there might know? Yeah, I think I was winning, but <laughs> but I lost the advantage. Yeah, definitely plus three. Here I already wasn't so winning, I think, yeah. And in the opening, well, plus five. Yeah, I played definitely badly. Oof. Uh, 94 would have been even stronger. Yeah, so that was a really up and down game. What, King G5? Ah, King G4 didn't do that. Yeah, that was wonderful. <laughs> it was almost win for all game. Well, but okay. Wait, what? Huh? What? Weird. <laughs> Uh-huh. Lol. Okay, so basically, I, yeah, that was so blunderful. 4, 2, 5, 4, 1, 3. Here we got 4. It was so winning. Oh, wow. Yeah, 94. Bah. <laughs> Wasn't the perfect game of all time. But I won at the end. Six. Is it draw? Oh, <laughs> I don't like some. Uh, well, I mean, they are good puzzles, but I'm not a fan. My mind just doesn't work to draw. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Wow. Plus seven. From plus seven to minus three, then to plus three, then to equal, then to. Okay. <laughs> Queen h5, I moves his pawn, queen d5 and I win. Uh, yeah, I don't know what was good in the explanation. Basically, he's forced to play g6 and yeah. Do you play d takes c on Pathand? Maybe, maybe not. I think, uh, bishop h6. Yeah, and what? That I gave away my queen? And what? <laughs> yeah, so basically he's kind of forced to take, then bishop g7 forcing him to take. And a rook h7 mate. Nice. Mm -hmm. You go, c1. Yeah, I made a rook c1 with some threats in future. Key e2 is even maybe more threats in future. I think maybe a kidney two and then like rook b1 trapping his queen at least trying. Uh, maybe. Now maybe I somehow like play queen e5, queen e1, kidney two. Ah, uh, kidney two. Well, I don't like it anymore. Uh, okay, I. I I wasn't sure what was here. Oh wow, that's a lot. Just yeah, I felt like some said give away a rook. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I didn't calculate ninety seven. Oh well. Rook up three and then ninety four, ninety five. So yeah, so rook up three. Well, I guess he's kind of forced to take. Then I take his force to take, of course. This king g4 only move, that king h4 only move, that mate. Hmm, here it should be queen g7, wait. Um, yeah, I mean, wait, that calculated. Or maybe not exactly that, but I'm um, queen sacrifice. Maybe bishop h6. 
Yeah, so bishop h6, he takes knight, bishop d7, king j8, force, bishop e5. He's forced to play bishop d5, then I will take his rook, and yeah. Oh, that's some stalemate, wait, wait, wait. King h1, e1, that's a stalemate. Yeah, king h1. King h3, or king h2. <laughs> no, king h2, he, he can promote to a knight, knight f3, it's not a stalemate. Knight h3, e1, queen, knight f3, that's a draw. So you can go knight f4, then king h2, and then e1, knight, he should be good, so king h1. It was king h3, ah, king f, no, yeah, king h3, king g2, here, here, and then e1, ah, king g3, and king g3 is still made, and one of the knights would fall. Ah, yeah, that's a cool puzzle. <coughs> What to do here? Hmm. Let's see, rook e4, f takes e, queen f4, <coughs> queen d7, rook g4 something rich gotta have something yeah okay six correct three fail great let's have a look at the game of of Ernie McCracken against Matoy now I'll be back in a few minutes
Hello again, oh, I'm here. So let's analyze the game. It was 4 1 3 for my opponent, 4 2 5 for me. So basically, yeah, e4 is a huge blunder. You have to go for d takes c, and it would be fine. Here at knight d4, so kind of forcing him to take. Then he moves his knight, d takes e, I have super strong pawns, d3 threat, and I'm completely winning. But I'm still completely winning, plus 6, queen e5 is a blunder. I'd go for knight h3, g takes h, queen g3, this, 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 check, here, check, that, and then rook e5, rook g5, and I should win this. Queen g5 blunder, I to take on a7, knight a7. There is bishop h3, g takes hf, queen g5, rook e3, I'm winning, so yeah, basically he need to play rook e1, and here I am slightly better. Queen f2 blunder, you go for knight h5, king f2 blunder, he had to take bishop f2, this, this, king f8, mistake from me, he, I had to go for a4, this, this, h4 mistake, I had to go for king f3, and here I had to go for rook c8, because basically <coughs> I thought that <coughs> would be winning, but yeah, it wasn't here. You know, for the draw, I denied. I tried to win. Here, can you find one? I'm here to go for can five. Maybe that was a mouse slip. I'm not sure. So, can you five and a complete draw? Uh, but okay, here I go for king g4. If rook g6 and that, if king here, that here, and I take. I'll win the pawn and the game. And if rook a6, <coughs> oi, 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 that's a mouse slip. If rook a6, I give an in betweener and then a 4 and I push. So basically, yeah, that if rook a6, I would win. Uh, but that, and here I want time in equal position 3mg, Mokosevich. Good game. Yeah, knight h3, and if king h1, knight f2, this win b6. That is this third knight a7, there is queen a7, and I'm winning. Wait, knight h5, a4, rook c8, and king g4. <coughs> For him, d takes c, bishop f2, king f4, and king f5. Okay, download pgn. <laughs> Fun fact, I made much more mistakes well on mistake only one more but i made two more blunders and one more mistake than he did that's interesting he would know <coughs> i was waiting almost for all game oh well so from the open it was all good okay that wasn't the best that's an extra to go for c takes d um bishop d2 this this here yeah, that's a blunder. You had to go for d takes c. Queen c5. Rook fd1. And it would be <coughs> slightly better. Here. That's a mistake from me. I'd go for knight d4. Knight d4 that. And I'm winning. Let's see, knight e5 that. Still completely winning. That's a blunder. I have to go for knight h3. <coughs> then if this and that here. And rook e3, a cool move. <coughs> this rook f2, queen g3. And I'm completely... Wait, this, this. Here. Rook g2, queen f3, I'm winning. If king e1, knight g4, and I'm also completely winning. And if basically king h1, there is... Knight f2, rook f2, queen b6, knight a7, queen a7. I'm also winning. Okay, here, that's a blunder. I have to go for rook a7. He takes, I play bishop h3, and then he's forced to take here, this, queen f2, queen g5. And I'm winning because his knight is far away, and I would have very good position. That's a mistake from me, I to go for knight h5. Then he would play like rook f1, and he's better, because yeah, he, even though he's exchanged down my piece, I'm very bad coordinated. That's a blunder, he had to go for bishop f2, then rook e7, bishop c5, rook d7, and he's completely winning. <coughs> uh, these, so here I'm whole exchange up. <coughs> here, that same mistake, I'd go for 
A4, that would be better. Yeah, I thought about it, but then I didn't like bishop b5, but then rook e5. We take, say, c5, z, c's. Rook fd5. And yeah, I'm basically much better. That, then here, that was a mistake. I had to go for b6, so rook c8. Then king e4, b6, king e4, rook c d8, uh, rook f2, rook e8, bishop d3, rook e1. Then basically better because, yeah, after rook trade, it was a complete draw. Here, he made a blunder. Um, king f5, or it was a mouse slip, or intent. Intently played it. You had to go for king f5, rook b3, king e5, and that's a draw. Uh, but okay, rook b3 is a blunder from me. I had to go for king g4, rook g6 here, here, and play rook b5, protecting a5 pawn, that, that, and him winning. And basically, here at one time, any proposition 3 mg Morozevich. Good game. Yeah, I could have used my advantage, but I did not. And yeah, mm, okay, it's two hundred in first game. I remember. Larichera, ah, Larichera, yeah, it was worse. I remember. Remember that? Oh yeah, I also remember that. It's completely lost. I want a pawn. Then I want a piece. I'm gonna know. Oh well. Okay, let's go here. Uh, computer. And let's play in slow 22. Good luck. I think I took. Some games before, and then he played like queen b6. Ooh. Ooh la la. It's interesting. I remember when I was. Oh, sorry. Um, even back then, when I was challenging Komodo, I was playing. I think against level 20 that he played this very often. Let's see, knight b5. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's. Why not to win? <laughs> yeah, because I think he should not be better here. I'm pretty sure. Let's see, knight c7. Knight d5, knight d5, bishop b8. Well, it's an exchange, I think. I can, I guess, repeat move once and see. I can play knight b5, Then, he, but then he has king d8. Um... Well, 95, yeah, I really want to win an exchange, but I'm not sure. Well, I think if I will repeat moves once, it won't be bad. Oh, maybe it was not perfect. <laughs> oh, he actually surprised me. Wee, yoy. Interesting play from my opponent. Maybe I need 95. But maybe that is better, I'm not so sure. <coughs> Yeah. Um, let's see, I can play bishop c7. I think he'll play like queen c6 there. Then bishop b8, a takes b. I have like queen d2, rook c1, rook c7. I'm not so sure. Um, oh, but then if this queen c6 takes here, there is bishop b5. Here, queen c7, king e6, queen c8. That's good. Let's go for it. Let's see. We'll take here. Queen c7. Queen c8. Mm hmm. Hmm. 
Hmm. Let's see. I'm just gonna change up. I can castle, which is not great, but well, <laughs> I'm gonna change up. So <laughs> even if I can castle, it's not a disaster for sure. Um, I'm thinking. Um, mm -hmm. How can I try to get even bigger advantage? Yeah, yeah. And I change it a bit too late. Well, of course it's nice, but of course I want more than just an exchange. Just an, an just an exchange. Now did I say? I'm not sure, but I did say so. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Like I don't know, Rook C one. I'm not sure, like rook d1 and then e4 is interesting. <sighs> Definitely feel like something good. Maybe it's even like something crazy. I'm not sure, but long side castle then like rook h1 e4. <laughs> that may be interesting. Maybe not. Good. <laughs> yeah, I need to think about that also. <laughs> well, maybe the sin is I don't have anything better than that. Well, I think I will play bishop g3 just to put my bishop away. I don't know why, but yeah, <laughs> I just did it and that's all. Let's play queen c3. I take in his rook. Then I'm thinking about or castling bishop g7 or playing rook d1, bishop g7, queen d3, and then trading. Or maybe a4, let's see. a4 is interesting. Bishop g7, though. Queen g7, queen b4, I lose a queen. And I'm not sure if I really want that. Let's see. a4, bishop g7, queen d2. Queen six, rook c one, queen b six. Then I can just castle. A four, queen c four takes takes rook c one, king d five, castle rook d one. That is, also looks pretty good. A four, queen a six, I have b five. Yeah, let's try it. Okay, yeah, bishop g seven. That was planned. I think. I think it was. Wait, what did I plan? Oops, I forgot what I planned. Ah, not the best thing to. <laughs> yeah, that's not the best thing to have. I forget what you planned a minute ago. But okay, I think it was queen d2. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so that, that. King e2, rook h1. e4. d4. Four or well, d takes e queen a two, king f six, queen d five. His knight hangs and mate. If king f five, there is queen f seven. So takes takes these these. Oops, these e four. He has knight f six also. That may be an issue, but I'm not sure. Um. Well, if I'm just scared, I can take. Take queen d1, bishop c3, that, 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 bishop b4, that basically already. Well, I think I will take, so why am I thinking? Now I think I will play king e2. Rook a1, maybe e4. Not so sure about e4, but I'm pretty sure I want to play king e2. I'm not sure about e4 because king e2, rook h1, e4, knight f6, and yeah, I'm not sure. Let's see, these, z. Ah, uh, yeah. This, this, knight f6. Uh, queen g5? Oh, queen f4, yes, knight e4. Um. Where's my easy win? <laughs> I can play f3 and then, like, idea. Oh, I don't know. Here. E4, this, this, what, I'm not sure. Uh, there is still a reason for scared. 
Yeah. You can always go for it. <sighs> Maybe I'm scared. So I didn't see anything like good in short amount of time. I'm worried if it's not in short amount of time, he will already get counterplay. So, you need to that e4, knight f6, f3. If rook b1, I have. I think bishop h4. Uh, D takes either his queen a2 and then after. Well, knight d5? I cannot take and rook b2 is this threat. If I take here, knight, knight c3. So this, 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 knight f6, f3, rook b1, bishop h4, and go knight d4. I'm not sure if you'll get anything super good there. Wait, I forgot what was this. Here, 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 f3, rook b1, bishop h4. Uh, what was the move? He takes e, then I take bishop f6, queen a2, king f6, queen f4, queen e4. So that, that, e4, f3, e4, knight f6, f3. If rook a1, for example, I have bishop h4, yes. Bishop h4. <laughs> um, then I did bishop f6. Um, knight e4 doesn't doesn't work. If d takes c, I have bishop f6. Ef bf6. Ff takes c. Queen d5. Threat. So he'll probably take e takes f. Then I will take g takes f. Maybe can f3. And bishop f6. I'll just go for it, if I'm scared. Ah, I, I, I will go for it. Oh, and now bishop 3. Hmm. <laughs> I already thought <laughs> he won't take my pawn. That would be awesome. But okay, though I think he... Nah, let's see. Uh -huh. Let's play rook c1. Here. I want to take them. <laughs> Your skin d6, and then my pawn might fall. Ay, Not sure, not sure. <laughs> I can play. Like, I don't know, b6. He takes with the knight rook b1. Bishop c. Oops. Bishop c5. There is here, and then rook b7. b6. He has bishop c5, then I have like bishop c7. Takes, takes. If he doesn't take, I can play it. Rook a1, rook a7. <sighs> How can he attack my pawn? I think with like knight on d6 or a7 or c7. I can just play rook b1 and the attack is over, I think. But I'm not sure. So this here, f4. <laughs> See, f3. Oh, I think if I'll take it, it will be good. Because <laughs> he cannot attack with dark square bishop, light square pawn. <laughs> I think my logic is correct here. Mm-hmm. Well, g3, h3, I'm not sure. h3. g3, f4. Eh, I'm not sure about g3, but I can always go g4 if I'm scared. Yeah, I can go now. Yeah, let's go for it. Um, 
e4 d4 ah rook c4 should be good but e4 you can do that that can have four rook f1 uh oh oh <laughs> i'm not sure i want to give him many play actually if i want to give him many okay well rook h1 he can't eat my pawn so i will try maybe to maneuver a bit mm -hmm. well i'm not sure if forcing him to play f6 was good or bad let's see rook h5 guinea six yeah, rook h1, b6, mm -hmm. rook c1, that's either king d7 or bishop c5. Ugh. Mm -hmm. E4, D4, and I like King E5, that's what I'm not sure I would really like. If you play E5 now, no, he does not. Um, if you would, <laughs> then it would be good. Uh, 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 Rook C2. Mm -hmm. GF, EF. Rook G1. So let's see, what if I like make a move? You may play a 4 e4, d takes c and f3, creating a passed pawn. That may be, may happen. If I play rook e1, that all can happen. And I don't really like this. If I play g takes f, there is e takes f. Well, yeah, I think he will play it. Rook f1, f4. Then, I mean, I guess I'm kind of forced to play e4, that, and then he has g4. By his own. So by rook g1 now he has he takes f. Uh, wait. He has f4. <laughs> yeah. Wait a second, actually, f4, gf, this, this, rook c5, b takes c, b6. <laughs> a queen versus five pawns. Though, if this, king f5, rook c5, b takes c, b6, and I, then I promote. Aha, that's an interesting scene to consider. This, this, I will play f4, he's forced to take, take, king f4, rook c5, b6, and I promote, should be winning. So, this, this, this. These, these, you won't take. Then I have something. So let's take. He's forced to take with the pawn. Then I play f4. Here. He's forced to go or king e6 or king d6. Now I'll play rook h1. Rook h1. Let's see, rook h6. King F7? No. Okay, Bishop G1. King E2. I think I can walk a bit with my king. I think not a lot though. But a bit. Just a bit. Let's see, King G3. Can't play Bishop B3 because of Rook F6. I think. Huh. Rook F6 now. D4, rook f5. Cannot really do anything. I'll get a passer. That sounds interesting. So rook here, d4, rook f5. King e6, rook e5, king d6. Mm -hmm. Rook f6. Ah, so basically he wants me to take. And he will play king d6, but then d5 pawn is a hanging pawn. Then I can play king f3. If he'll play king c5, I can play like, I don't know, maybe play king d3. No matter what, he'll move. 
Yes, he won't take because of rook d5. He can play king c4. Then can play rook h5. Plays like bishop c5. Then if uh, maybe not bishop c5, but I don't know, like bishop c3. So idea of pushing d4, f5, king b5, f6. I have a draw. <laughs> As if think like that. If he's going for it, I think it won't be bad for him. I can immediately push rook h5, king c5, f5. So he doesn't have time to think much. Well, yes, then king b5. If I play f6, that's good. Uh, that's a draw, I mean. That's super good, but a draw is a draw. Uh, rook h6, king c5, f6. Well, I will take and we'll see. Yeah, king d6. Um, king f3, king c5, king e2. Then king c4 and he may push. Yeah, I don't have one tempi, tempo. Rook h5. <coughs> Here f5, king b5, I have f6, easy draw, but I can play rook h6 and try to win. Let's play f5. Yeah, okay. Uh, now I think it's a choice. Or go for a draw or not go for a draw. Let's see, rook h6. Like, let's think what, how he can play bestly. King c4, f6. Bishop e5, king f3, d4, this, bishop g7, rook here. Mm. Feels like a big risk. I try. I really want to have a big risk. I don't know. Rook h6. In c4. <coughs> rook c6. I have there. So let's play rook h6. I guess. I will try to win this. Okay. Bishop p3 is attacking the rook. Here, let's play rook e6. Attacking his bishop. Okay, goes for that. F6. Let, let's not lose any tempos. Here I have rook e5, d3. King f3, king c4, rook c5, we take c. F7, king 3, f8, queen, I should win. Rook e5, he may play king c6. It does not help him. Rook e5, king c4, rook c5, we take c, f7, d3, f8, d2, queen f3. So rook e5, d3, f2, he doesn't move his king, d2, f rook d5, I guess. Rook e5, if he plays king c6, this b takes c, he's in time. That's actually true. But rook e5, king c6, I can play king f3, so I'm also in time. d3, then rook c5, b takes c, f7. Let's play rook e5. I think I should lose now. Okay, it goes for d3. Now, I think I will play c f7 with f8 threat. So he is forced to play d2. Then we will play rook d5. Yes, f8 threat. He moves his king and play rook d2. b5, and then I basically should win. So f7 now. Now rook d5. Now rook d2. Now I allow for his bishop. Well, I'm completely win, I know, but <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> and, and let's say I'm not panicking, I'm just a bit scared to draw it all. Guess I can't really lose here. Unless I have a huge amount of sleep. I'm scored, so scared rook d8, b5, king f3, I don't know, like, and then bishop c5, king e2, b4, king d1, b3, king c1, king v1, <laughs> yeah, I think I am that scared, so, maybe king f3 to not lose any tempos, <laughs> yeah, let's go for king f3, king e2, um, king d1, and if king b2, I have rook d5, King b3, I play king c1, king b1. Yeah, king b1, then I win. Yeah, that was sweaty. I think he had a draw. But I think he played a bit too risky. 
Well, it's a rangaroo, but it's not a rangaroo. <laughs> yeah, that would be funny. Uh, not so funny. But <laughs> okay. It technically would be really funny, but probably I wouldn't laugh so much. Rook c5 and basically slowly but surely pushing his skin. King g4. Now I'll play king g5. This does not pre move. He might play king h5. He does not. Now we'll play king h5. Look in here. This. This and then he'll go king h3. Oh no, that and that. Yes! Game level 22. I think I maybe played not by the best way, but I did win. So my two against Sandy McCracken. That's the game I watched. Yeah, here I thought about, yeah, oops. These, these, Bishop F7, yeah. Ernie would have been a pawn up. But that, then it was equal for a while. And could you say I'm mistaken? Go for King Basically, this minus pawn. And so, yeah. Oh wait, I didn't click game review. Oh well. Yeah, that was sweaty. I think maybe I played a bit too weirdly. Uh, I was plus 6.2! Or even 6.3! And then Yeah, and then it was zero point nine. Oh rook h six was uh, actually a better move. Okay. So I basically was completely winning. Ba -ba 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 Wait, review. So so basically eighty eighty two dot two for me, seventy eight dot seven for him. One brilliant move for me, zero for him. Four great move for me, zero for him. Forty best move for me, thirty eight for him. Twenty three best move for me, twenty nine for him. Seven good move for each of us. Six good move for me, five for him. Uh, nine x for me, seven for him. Two mistakes for me, two for him. Zero lunch for me, two for him. And zero missions for each of us. Let's see. Yeah, you can see, I think that was free game. Okay, Slav. Wait, one mistake. Yeah, I know that it's a mistake. I know it, but I, I also know that they play 94 always, so I just cannot cannot hold it inside me. <laughs> this move doesn't hurt. Do you mean E3? No. E3 is actually a bad move. So there's a piece. I mean, yeah, pawn is technically a piece. I'm not sure. We need to also know. Um... Hmm, 95? Rook B1? Rook C1? Not Rook C1. Okay, if you want to save a piece. Ah, A3! And basically Queen B2, Knight A4. That's a great move. Then, yeah, I'm completely winning. We should be five for a brilliant move. Then Queen C3 is a great move. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Yeah, okay, that loses a piece. Kicking okay, F3 would have been better. Uh, to strength winning material. I mean, do you mean Rook H? I mean, do you mean that's weird. Rook H4? Oh, okay. And then, yeah, maybe, maybe not by the fastest way, but I got my first win against level 22. So plus only 1.5 for me, and 83.7 in total. Let's see, analysis, analysis. I want to see here. What's getting too bad? Yeah, it was. Mm -hmm. Yeah, basically e4, that's all what I calculate f3 then? No, queen d4? Ah, he takes this threat, so he's forced to take it. That would have been so much easier win, actually. Because, yeah. 94 is kind of forced. 
As always, if he does not play it, I have probably or queen b6 I would have played. Maybe I would have just taken here, queen b6. And yeah, I'm completely winning. But still, I won. That's great. That's awesome. That's awesome stream. Hope you enjoyed it. If you didn't, please join at my club on Discord, Team Film Club. And my club, there are 165 members. Thank you all very, very much. So, 35 more members, and I will in tournament. 200 members, so I will be very happy. And also, please join on my team on Chess, Pesh Pesh Club. Now, in my team, there are. Now I'm 58 members, thank you very very much. So 42 members and I will make tournament. Once I'm members, so always I will be very happy. And thank you for following only chess on YouTube and Twitch and as usual. Please button and subscribe to me and please on video and please join chess club and chess and also please join Discord. You'll join my Discord, you'll get notifications when I stream on Twitch and won't post videos on YouTube. Link in the description, yeah. Bye bye, come back, see you soon, see you tomorrow, and fun you know, stay cool.